we are going to see how to generate negative voltage with triple five timer IC so let's get started For this we need a IC, it is triple five primary IC, here it is pin number 7 and 6 and 2. These both pins are connected together, one 10 kilo ohms resistor is connected between pin number 7 and 6 and 2. With this resistor we have to connect one capacitor and then here it is ground. Its value is 10 nanofarad or 0 0.01 microfarad. These both are same. Pin number 1 is connected to the ground and pin number 5 this is also connected with 10 nanofarad capacitor and then it is connected to ground. Pin number 4 and 8 these both are connected together. One 2.2 kilo ohms resistor is connected between positive voltage and pin number 7. Here we will apply plus 12 volt. You can connect any positive voltage below 15 volt. Now with the pin number 3, we will connect one capacitor, it is 22 microfarad, its positive pin is connected to pin number 3 and negative pin is connected to cathode pin of a diode and from here we will get negative voltage. It is normal diode 1 and 4007. In between these two components, we have to connect another diode and its anode pin is connected to this and the cathode pin is connected to ground and here we have to connect one capacitor its negative pin is connected to here and the positive pin of the capacitor is connected to the ground its value is 100 microfarad and this IC is triple five we have to connect another resistor in between negative voltage and the ground it is 10 kilo ohms it is load resistor so this is the circuit. Now we will see this circuit on the breadboard. Triple 5 IC. Pin number 4 and 8. These both are connected to positive rail. One is connected to the ground. Pin number 5 is connected to the ground through 10 nanofarad capacitor. Also pin number 2. Pin number 6 and 2. These both are connected together. 2.2 kilo ohms resistor is connected between pin number 7 and positive rail. 10 kilo ohms resistor is connected between pin number 7 and 6. Positive pin of the capacitor is connected to pin number 3. It is 22 microfarad capacitor. Cathode pin of the diode is connected to negative pin of the capacitor. And from here, we will get the negative voltage. I will connect here. In this point, we have to connect one diode. Anode pin of the diode is connected to here. And cathode pin is connected to ground. We have to connect one capacitor. In this point, the negative pin of the capacitor is connected here. And positive pin of the capacitor is connected to negative rail or ground. It is 100 microfarad. Positive and negative rails are connected and one load resistor is connected between negative voltage and the ground. Now our circuit connection is completed. Now here I am connecting the ground and the positive. Power supply is connected. Now we need two multimeters. One is to check the positive voltage or the input voltage and another one to measure the negative voltage. I am connecting this multimeter between positive rail and the negative rail. Here I am applying 12 volt. And this one to check the negative voltage. As you can see there is no negative symbol here but in this meter we can see the negative symbol 
and we are getting negative 9.5 volt when we are applying positive 12 volt as we are applying 12 volt so we can write as here it is written here plus 12 volt so we can write negative 9.5 volt now see the other voltages when we are applying 11 volt then we will get 8.5 volt at 10 volt we will get 7.5 volt at 9 volt we will get minus 6.5 volt at 8 volt in the input side we will get negative minus 5.5 volt at 7 volt we will get 4.6 volt at 6 volt we will get 3.6 negative 3.6 and at 5 volt we will get minus 2.6 volt at 4 volt minus 1.7 volt at 3 volt it is 860 millivolt at 2 volt it is very little voltage at negative so at 5 volt so if you need negative 5 volt then you have to apply positive 7.4 volt then only you will get negative 5 volt and this circuit is only applicable at low current requirements you cannot use this circuit at high current requirements for that you have to use other circuit I will upload that later so guys this is all for today i hope you like this video if so then please like share and subscribe to my channel and if you have any doubt on this then please let me know in the comment section in the next video i'll show you another topic till then stay happy and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching